Hello everybody and welcome back to my channel. I hope that you're all doing really, really well. We're in the kitchen again because you can tell from the title I've got another weekly Aldi haul. Uh, before I start this video I just want to say thank you to all of my new um, subscribers. I just want to say hi to all my new subscribers. Welcome to the fam. Um, you guys are you're amazing. I'm getting subscribers every single day. I'm growing every day. I'm all in the green and um, welcome to the fam. I'm really, really trying to hit 500 subscribers by the end of the year. I'd really, really appreciate it. I've currently got 400 and... 64 so i only need another let's do the maths 36 subscribers by end of year so i'm hoping that i can do that and really trying to make sure that i'm in focus for you guys um so if you are new to my channel hi welcome uh please do hit the subscribe button it really really helps me out uh welcome to the fam also as well if you do like this type of content i do vlogs hauls challenges lifestyle in general that is the type of content that i do so if you do like that type of content i really appreciate it if you do hit the subscribe button also as well please make sure that you hit the bell notification in the corner to make sure that every single time i upload a video you guys are notified about it and as well i'd really appreciate if you could give this video a massive thumbs up whenever you thumbs up my video or dislike it whichever whichever one takes your fancy um that's the engagement that i need and every time you uh thumbs up my video it tells you that you like the type of content and it pushes my video out until the algorithm and it beats the algorithm and it pushes my channel and me um out to the forefront of youtube and it just lets more people find me and my channel and my content and i'd really really appreciate it so as you can tell by the title of the video we've been to aldi now also as well if you can see some oil in my hands i'm going away for the weekend tomorrow after work so i've just checked the oil the water and everything in the car so i'll have to put some oil in the car i have washed my hands but if you can see oil just ignore it um so some of the stuff that we've got in this haul as well is for the weekend because we are going away to um uh, Easington which is the bottom end of the east coast um so I literally just need to fuck off somewhere for the weekend and just have like a literal no filming no work no emails no phone uh literally just switch off from social media and literally just relax before the madness of Christmas is about to happen because there's just so much going on that literally I'm running out of time every day like there's just so much going on so yeah there's some things in this haul as well um for the weekend so the first thing that i'm going to show you guys is i've got the um copy of the pepsi max again if you guys don't know what this is it basically is the uh zx vive cola extreme taste zero sugar you get six in a box for one pound 39 so i got two so i literally got 12 cans of this for like two pound 88 two pound 87 whatever it is um so yeah, it's literally just tastes like Pepsi Max, but it isn't the price of Pepsi Max. So that's the first thing. The second thing that I've got is a pack of original LucasAids. Um, if you drink any other LucasAid apart from the original one, I literally do not trust you because all of the flavours are disgusting. And they were £2.49 for four. They are the medium size as well. So the first thing that I've got is this for capture. This is for Saturday night. We're going to have a tapas night. So a lot of the bits that we've got is for the tapas night. So this is the Carlos Garlic Tear and Share. The Carlos range is a copy of the Pizza Express range. Aldi do also sell the Pizza Express range as well, but obviously it's a lot more expensive than their version. Um, the receipt is somewhere, but I can't remember which bag it's in. I can remember the prices for some of the stuff, but not everything. I think this is about £1.49, and it says, It's a garlic tear and share for capture, a light and fluffy tear and share bread topped with garlic spread. So that's the first food thing there. We get them all the time, and they are really, really nice. The next thing that I've got are these Scottish rough oat cakes because we're doing like, uh, we've got salsa dips, we've got cheeses to put on the crackers. These are really cheap. I think these are about 69p. And they are the Save Your Bakes, um, low sugar, high in fibre, made with whole grain oats. So that's them there. The next thing that I've got are these 12 Let's Party Sticky Chicken Skewers. Um, you get 12 in there, they're just like the little party food again for the tapas night. We've had these before, really, really nice. These were £1.49 for them. The next thing that I've got is this Nor Pack. It's literally Lur Pack. Spreadable, it's literally a copy of Lur Pack. Lur Pack now is about £6 for a tub of Lur Pack. So this is the Spreadable Nor Pack. Uh, Lur Pack, like I said, in Sainsbury's is literally £6 now. I think it is absolutely ridiculous. I don't even know how they can justify it at all. I think it is a madness. This is about £1.49 um, and it is a 500 gram tub. 
The next thing that I've got is the Deli Chunky Salsa Dip. This is really, really nice. I've had this before. Um, I think that was about 99p. The next thing that I've got, which I am literally so excited about, is this specially selected indulgently creamy baking camembert. Uh, and it is the second strength one. And I literally, this baked, melted with the focaccia bread. Oh. Wow, I can't remember much that was. I think about, about a couple of pounds or something like that. And then I've showed you guys these before. They're the Snap Right Pretzel Fins. It's these here. These are so nice, literally. The honey and mustard and onion flavour, 99p each. They're just a whole vibe. The next thing that I've got is this Brussels and Shallots Pate. It is the deliciously smooth pork liver pate and subtle shallot jelly. And it's that one there. It's the uh, specially selected one. This was £1.69, I remember that. So that's that there. We've got some like um, bread that we're gonna bake. Not the focaccia, we've got that, but we've also got like, you know, the French breadsticks that you put in the oven and it's all warm and doughy and soft. Oh, in the camera, oh my God. Oh, speaking of them, they're here, look. It's literally these ones here. So these are the Village Bakery, two bake at home, white baguettes, and these both cook in 12 minutes each, and that's what it look like, it's like the big massive baguettes. Oh, that with a focaccia, absolutely. Oh, these are really, really fun. These are like proper, these look sick. These are the Mediterranean Magic Appetizers. Cream cheese bites garnished with red pepper, onion, herbs, garlic, and tomato. Have you seen them? Look at them. Wow. Like, they come in like a proper, like, little tray look. Can you see? I just thought they were really cool. They were 179 reduced from 199 And then the next thing is this French torsion ham. I think that's how you pronounce it. It's that there. That's it. So that, that's like big slices of ham. Look at that. That's like the size of my head. Six large eggs. I don't eat eggs. We got some Italian uh, prosciutto. Um, I really don't like the Spanish one. Um, the Spanish one, you can just taste pure fat and grease in it. It's actually horrible. But the Italian one is absolutely perfection. And then mum just picked up some more honey just because she needs some. Because she uses this instead of sugar, I believe. Oh, is that my brother? Oh, she has ginger and lemon on the morning with honey. Um, so yeah, that's the first bag. It's like, look at these for instance, the Holly Lane Bubble Min Rocky Road Mini Bites. These are a copy of the Marks and Spencers ones these as well, look. Look at that. They were £1.99 and they are just going to be like stuff like that. It, it looks like Aero, can you see? See there, look like it's all like the Aero mint chocolate there, look. Can you see? What a vibe. And the next thing that we've got is this Bally Castle limited edition chocolate hazelnut and caramel flavour country cream. Look at that. Nice bottle as well. I think this was 7 99 6 something like that. The next thing that we've got as well, like, this is what I mean, they've got like a lot of the Christmas bits in. So we've got the Hotel Collection Fur and Cedar Peppermint Layered Candle. So this is what it looks like and this comes with a lid. And then it is a, I don't know if you can see, but it's a two wick candle and Oh, it smells well nice. So that's literally for the living room. That was five ninety nine. That was actually reduced. I think it should have been about eight pounds, but we got it for. So that's gonna go straight in the living room after I have. Oh my god! I thought it was a candle going then. And then for the weekend away, I don't drink milk. So mum just got a little small milk for her. For like coffee and tea and stuff. The next thing that I've got is this Alma Luxurious Fabric Conditioner in the Lily and Bloom scent. This smells really nice. Really, really nice. Oh, yes. It reminds me of a um, perfume I'm used to wear, but I don't know which one it is. This is it here. This is the one. It's a new range. If you guys want to go check it out, that's the one. Two cans of baked beans. Nothing exciting there. The last thing that I'll show you is like the most Christmassy thing that we've bought. But I'll show you it last because it's actually quite messy. So the next thing that I've got are these snack right tortilla chips. These are for the dips and the salsa and everything else. So they were dirt cheap. I think they're about 79p, I believe, about 79p. And then mama picked up these little like yogurts in like these glass jars. And this is the Cherry Farmhouse yogurt. 
and the salty caramel farmhouse sugar specially selected in like these little jar things. I think they're actually quite expensive. I can't remember how much they were, but I remember thinking, God, they're expensive. And then this is literally, I just got one porridge. Uh, that's for work tomorrow. Uh, so I've only got one day left. Uh, and then we've got, oh no, there's rosemary in these. I didn't know. My mum bought none either. Rosemary and garlic olives. They'll still be all right, but I'm not I'm not a fan of rosemary. But we've got these for the tapas night. I think they're about £1.49. And then bacon for breakfast. Ten slices smoked, obviously, because if you eat unsmoked bacon, there's something wrong with you. Some more pretzel thins. And then obviously, because we're not going to be there, we're only there two nights. And obviously we're going to be like out during the day and stuff and whatever. So we got a sliced tiger blue, but just a small one. You know, the half of one. You know, just for the breakfast on the morning. The next thing that we got for the tapas night are these. The deli chorizo and gudo rollitos. If you can see the like rolled look, it's like cheese rolled up in meat. Really, really nice. They're really nice though. And then obviously... As you guys know in these hauls, what the two flick and mix, if you don't know about them, they're literally a 340 gram bag of sweets and literally they're so nice. The next thing we've got is this garlic aioli dip, again, for the uh, crackers and everything. And then for the breakfast sausages, Cumberland sausages. And then we've also got a little mozzarella for the pass bar. Tapas bar, tapas buffet. This is a uh, quiche. This is just, I think this is for my dad. This is just for you. This is not taking this with us. Um, and then we've got oh, the Wesley Dale with cranberry cheese. Oh, I can't wait to go and do the proper like Christmas food shop because I'm getting all because I'm in charge of the cheese board. You see, because I'm a I'm a bit of a cheese board connoisseur. You know, I love a good cheese board, and I'm in charge of it. Um, so I'll be getting all the cheeses this year. Then we've got this cocktail antipasti mix that's got like all the stuff in. Can you see? Like all the bits in, look. That's it. Right there. Sorry if the. There we are. You can see. It's got all like the pickled stuff in it. And then this is mine. This is a specially selected smooth and luxurious salted caramel. That's it there. Look at that. Look at that. Oh, darling. Yes. The next thing that we've got are these specially selected four cheese and caramelised onion rolls. I saw these and were like, mum, just throw them in a basket, yeah. Apart, this is the last food item that I've got. <clears throat> so I really like popcorn. I've not had it for absolutely ages. And then there's this snack right one, and it's this toffee flavoured coated one. Look, I think it was like, I think about 99p with dirt cheap. So that is all the food, guys. So the last thing that I'm going to show you is like the most Christmassy thing. That we've got this is the last thing that we got look we've got a reef now we've already got a reef on the front door but we're on for the side door as well and this was literally 9.99 look at that 9.99 but i think this is actually real I, this is i don't think this is i don't think this is fake i think this is actually i think this is real so i don't know if it's gonna last this is real yeah that's real but yeah 9.99 for that and it's just got all like these details on look can you see that look at that so i just thought it looked really nice on the side door so that was 9.99 so that is everything everything that we've got just let me put this reef down a sec so that is everything that i got in the haul guys um i hope that you enjoyed it i love doing these like weekly shop things so all this food it's sort of like a bit of a restock for the house trip for the week, but then also we're going away for the weekend. So it's a bit of a mix match of everything. And then obviously we've got the reef and like the candle and stuff. But yeah, that is pretty much everything. So all of that come to £85, which mum nearly fell through the floor with. Um, but we got two, like I said, I got two of the boxes of coke as well, but one is in the boat because we're taking it with us tomorrow. But that is everything, guys. So I hope that you did enjoy this uh, haul. And um, if you did, like I say, please do get a big massive thumbs up. It really, really helps me out more than you even know. Uh, so if you did like it, please do get a thumbs up. And as well, like I said, if you haven't hit the subscribe button yet, please make sure to do so because it really, really helps me out. And come and join the fam. Also, as well, like I've said, if you haven't hit the bell notification in the corner, please make sure to do so because every time we load a video, it means that you guys will be notified about it and you will not miss any of my content. So, guys, I hope that you all have an incredible week and I will see you all 
in this video. Bye guys.